Let's get right to it. Machine learning models are not black boxes. Just because most people don't understand the math and code behind these models, it doesn't mean they're black boxes. Wait, what's a black box? Here's a great definition of what a black box is in the computing world. I like the second part of the definition where it says, broadly, anything that has a mysterious or unknown internal function or mechanism. If we use that, there's nothing unknown or mysterious about machine learning models. I've created an entire course on authoring machine learning models from scratch. You can see the code for all the top models in that course. There's absolutely nothing hidden. I'll put a link below on Quora to a post where I go over a regression model from scratch. So where does this come from? This notion that machine learning models are black boxes. Well, the culprits here are deep learning models or deep neural networks. Ideally, if you were to look into these models, you should find a nice set of neurons looking for clear and clean features. But unfortunately, that's not the case, mostly because the neurons don't show specificity. They're mostly broadly tuned and seemingly with random features. Because of this broad and noisy-like response from the models in the network, it's very difficult to explain how typical DNNs work. There's also a lot of redundancies because removing one node isn't going to harm the performance of the model, especially if it generalizes well to start. Okay, with that said, let me amend what I said earlier. Most machine learning models are not black boxes. It's true that we don't understand the decisions made by many deep learning models. Have you seen the AlphaGo documentary? It's a must watch for anyone in AI. If not, I'll put a link to it in the comments section. There's a point in the movie when the programmers believe the model is a bug. The model makes a move that's completely outside of what a top Go player would make. It wasn't a bug. The model simply went about winning the game in a way that was unconventional. In conclusion, most machine learning models are not black boxes. Check out that AlphaGo documentary if you can. I created LogicBot for two reasons. One, to help people transition to a machine learning engineering role that are already in a data role. And in a data role, I mean heavy SQL. Number two, train those who aren't in an entry-level role as a data analyst. The data analyst is the only entry-level data role I know of. Companies are looking for skills. You either have them or you don't. You either understand what certifications are and their importance, or you don't. The truth is, you don't have that many options. Companies are looking for very specific skill sets, and without them, you're not going to be working in any data role. There is a recipe, and you must follow it if you want to work in any real-world data role. Then move to data engineering or machine learning engineering later on. LogicBot has that recipe. You need to follow it and learn the skills and gain the certs necessary. It's that simple. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have a great day. We'll see you soon.